With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. The given question says that find the area of a parallelogram given in the figure. So we are given the following parallelogram A, B, C, D. Where the side BC is 17 cm, side CD is 12 cm and the diagonal BD is 25 cm. We are also required to find the length of the altitude from vertex A on the side DC. That means we are supposed to find out the value of this altitude that is which is on the vertex or which is on the side DC. Now let's call this point as point E. So we are supposed to find out the value of length A. This is D and this length is 12 centimeter. Now what we are going to do is we are going to find out first of all we are going to find out the area of the parallelogram. For that area of parallelogram will be equal to area of parallelogram that is ABCD will be equal to 2 times area of triangle ABC area of triangle B C D because the diagonal of the parallelogram divides the parallelogram into two triangles of equal areas. So if I want to find out the area of parallelogram then I, I just need to find out one of the area of one of the triangles and multiply it by two. Now let's find out the area of triangle BCD. For area of triangle BCD we are given we are going to find out this area by using Heron's formula and we are given the value of A, B and C. So A is equals to 12 centimeter b is equals to 17 centimeter and c is equals to 25 centimeter now let's find out the value of s that is semi perimeter semi perimeter is equals to a plus b plus c divided by 2 so putting in the values we will get s is equals to 12 plus 17 is 29 29 plus 20 25 is 54 so 54 divided by 2 is equals to 27 centimeter so this is the value of semi perimeter that is s so S is equals to 27 centimeter. Now let's uh, write down the formula which is uh, used to find out the area. Heron's formula says that area is equals to under root S, S minus A, S minus B, S minus C. Now let's put in the value to find out the area of BCD. So area BCD will be equal to area BCD will be equal to under root S, S is 27 multiplied by 27 minus a a is 12 27 minus b is 17 27 minus c c is 25 let's solve it on solving it we will get under root 27 multiplied by 27 minus 12 is 15 27 minus 17 is 10 27 minus 25 is 2 so this will give us under root 27 can be written as 9 multiplied by 3 and 15 can be written as 3 multiplied by 5 and 10 can be written as 5 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 2. Now on solving it we will get this 9 when it will go, come out of the square root we will have 3. This 3 is forming a pair so 3 will come out of the square root. 5 is forming a pair so 5 will come out of the square root. 2 is forming a pair so 2 will come out of the square root. On solving it we will get 90 centimeter square. This is the area of BCD. Now we are supposed to find out the area of ABCD. So the parallelogram. So the area of the parallelogram ABCD will be equal to 2 times area BCD that is 90. So this will give us 180 centimeter square. This is the answer to the first part of the question which is asking to us to find out the area of the parallelogram. Now let's move to the second part which, which asks us to find out the, the length of AE. Now we know that area of parallelogram is also equal to base multiplied by height base multiplied by height or altitude is equals to area of parallelogram because we are talking about the same parallelogram now we have base dc that is 12 centimeter dc is 12 centimeter multiplied by we are supposed to find out the length of ae ae is equals to on solving it we will get this is 180 so ae will be equal to 1 divided by 12 multiplied by 180 which will give us 15 centimeters so this is the length of the altitude that we are that has been asked in the question so a is equals to 15 centimeters that's all thank you
for class 6 to 12, ITJ and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.